Here she is. Let's go. <laughs> Sorry, I love it. That's amazing. Oh my goodness. Peloton <laughs> done in the lounge. That is how to kickstart a trip to Miami. Excuse the glasses, this is my travel look. But now we're gonna shower and then get on the plane. They have Pelotons in the lounge. I'm obsessed with this. Welcome to Miami. Look at the cocktails. Guys, we are in Miami. Whose batch is it? We're in Miami. We're in Miami. We are starting the day with a no makeup, self care dinner we're before eat. the batch begins. But the actual batch doesn't start until this weekend. We're here to beat the jet lag. So we're just going to go out and enjoy ourselves and just kind of have a nice little well being trip to start the trip. So let's go explore the hotel first and then eat. Room tour. The aesthetics in here are like my literal dream. I can hear Christina screaming. We've got the aesthetics of the M Shell home dream, haven't we? We've got two balconies. Gorgeous. Look at that like tanning bed. Yeah, that's like a tanning bed. But I'm like, do you even get sun on that? Because there's like a thing over it. Oh my goodness, the aesthetic in here. I'm so gonna copy this for my bed at home. It's divine. I can't wait to see what batch of the red tree she's got. We can get sorted. And then we go back through here. Da -da -da. Time to freshen up and get going for some food. Maybe night one outfits. Ooh. Christina is looking gorgeous. Woohoo! Let's go! This is cute. Oh. sleep and this hotel actually has amazing fitness classes so we're dashing down to do a beach sculpt class this is like my dream i am so excited to get on that beach i'm very sweaty because i've just put loads of sun cream on starting with a mindful message how lovely is that Okay, that was amazing. I forgot how stunning Miami Beach is. It's like just incredible. You've got the city on one side, the beach on the other. So I'm just walking to collect Christina, who's just been on a call on the beach. What a place to take a call. I did my workout, which was just incredible. It was so nice. It was kind of like a mix of yoga and body sculpting. Then we are gonna go and eat some breakfast because wow, it is going to be needed after that workout and this lovely little walk. Not a bad spot for a morning walk. Perfect, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Because tonight 
It's the night. All right, do I have that to like? We do ginger shots. Why? Why is it in a? I don't know. We have to do it in the straw. Can okay, you share with me? <laughs> oh, it's not right. Grisby does bacon oh, is. Wow, wow. Oh, real American bacon. And this is Huevo. Huevo Tanchero. Wow. Never had that before. It looks amazing. And just like that, we are out and about for our first official day, day in Miami. Miami. So, brunch, breakfast was amazing. I had steak and eggs, the most unlike me combo in the entire world. Yeah, but you also did a two hour workout, so you needed the extra protein. I know, well I didn't mean to. I did a workout, my own workout, and then I was like, Christina, they're doing a beach sculpt class. To be fair, it was only 35 minutes. Um, it was meant to be 60, but it was amazing. I just felt so privileged. I'm like, I can't believe I get to work out on this beach and move my body. So lucky. Yeah. Oh, and then we ancient. ate amazing food. You had huevos. Huevos rancheros. Huevos rancheros, which was, oh my God, amazing. amazing. And now we are just walking through the divine sweltering heat. I'm not mad about this heat. I'm here for it. The vitamin D is needed. Yes. And we are heading for to... Yeah, we're heading for more food. And to go shopping, because... Let's go shopping! <laughs> Get in, loser. We're going shopping. Get in, loser. Let's go shopping. <laughs> this place, the combi, does the most amazing taco. Coffee time! Thank you! Thank you! Mm -mm -mm. We got the coffee. We're walking. We're just Ooh, on Lincoln Sephora. Road. Yeah, Sephora. We're just on Lincoln Road, which is like. It's kind of touristy, but it looks like a it's road with loads of shops. It reminds me of Santa Monica Boulevard. It yeah, it's the, the shopping in Santa Monica. They have like, I remember when I first came to Miami, this is maybe like my sixth time in Miami, and this road is like the road that everyone tells you to come to because it's kind of like where all the shopping is and stuff. Like they just have kind of like restaurants in the middle, and then Lululemon, Sephora. All Saints in Miami, that is cool, yeah, wow. Christina's swimsuit didn't arrive, so we're actually looking for a swimsuit store. I feel like it's closed. Next stop, there is a Victoria's Secret, so I saw one. They do swim yeah. Let's go to Victoria's Secrets in pink and try and find a bikini. Oh, it's the Victoria's Secret smell. It smells so good. Oh, they have such nice beauty things. I'm looking for swimwear. Oh my gosh, I love these pajamas. Oh, they do have some white bottoms there, I can see. That's not what you want. <laughs> it's not the vibe. I think it's gonna be like a wrap over. Oh, what else? Oh, I like this with the gold detailing. This is my favorite one. It was 20 it was so bucks. <laughs> Wait, please see it on. Happy girl. We're hitting all the sales. Oh my gosh. Oh, interesting. I have this dress, this pink one. You have this one? Yeah, I got it from Amazon. Really good. And the swimsuits are so nice in here. Oh my gosh, that gold one. That's stunning. But I love the cover up. That is so nice. Also, look at this cover up. I love that so much. Cannot be H&M. H&M loves Miami. I love that. Oh, cute. Like everything is so nice. Nicest H&M store ever. And they have swimwear in stock. Yeah. That dress is giving me reformation vibes. Yeah. Oh, okay, so we they have sandals in here as well, actually. One's feeling the energy, she's feeling the hype. 
This is honestly the most stunning H&M I've ever seen. Miami Vice, baby. No, no, look at this one. Oh, I'm obsessed. I, I love that. Cheesecake come, come. Are we allowed to go in and look at the cheesecakes? Are they on display? No, but can we go and look? Oh my god. Cheesecake factory. She's like, I'm going to Sephora and not the Cheesecake Factory. I'm like, the Cheesecake Factory. No, we love the Cheesecake Factory, don't we? It's so good. So you're American and you love it. And then the Oreo cheesecake. It's so good. Chef's kiss. And the brown bread. The brown bread. I've never had the brown bread. We cannot have Cheesecake Factory. We have lots of other places to try. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Oh, we're yeah, we're gonna have a look. So it's like pop up brands. Yeah, all over the store. We have everything from perfume, makeup, oh. kayaks, sporting goods. Oh my god, I love it. You guys wanna Even get just like the aesthetic. Yeah, we love it. Oh my gosh, let's go and look gold. Yeah, there's a slide on the <gasps> second floor. Okay, go. we're going, we're going. <laughs> thank you. We yeah, love you. If anything, just come over to me. Oh, we oh. will. Thank you so much. This is so exciting. So this is like a pop up store. Guys, it's amazing. Like, look how stunning everything is. The vibe is immaculate. Summer water. I love that. Oh my god, look at this. My biggest dream is to calm down. <laughs> Me. I feel Literally. I feel attacked. Great gifts. This brand. How stunning. It is a body wash. Ooh. Oh. Demon just picks the stress relief up and goes, you need this. Yes. We found a slide. Did you find a ball pit? <gasps> Wait, I'm gonna film us in here. This is amazing. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> is that fun? <laughs> they have this brand in the UK, Water Drop. It's really good. It's really, really good. Water Drop. You like put it into your water, yeah. They give you a poster your meals. They taste really nice. Yeah, yeah I'm really impressed. No, this let's try this limited one. Sell it. But this is my favorite one. This one is apple with blackberry and blueberry. Ooh, it's I very like Christmassy. Oh. Excuse me, don't hear this. Like really good. Yeah, yeah. Take a video. This was awesome. Thank you so much. Bye. Oh, to Time Out Market quickly. To Time Out Market because the one in New York is amazing and this wasn't here the last time I came. Yeah, they're really good food markets. They had like a really good cookie dough at the one in New York. Yeah, they're really beautiful. And the scent. They have stuff. Yeah, they have so much stuff. They're all like different pop-ups generally. Oh my god, it smells so good in here. Wow. I'm just looking for chocolate. <laughs> Always looking for chocolate. Oh, cookies and ice cream. <gasps> Are you <laughs> kidding me? <laughs> Look at the Oreo. No, no, no. Are you kidding me? I bet they're not gluten free. Yeah. Oh. Wow. This. Oh my god. Wow. The problem is she's gluten free, and I bet they're not gluten free. So we literally had the coolest afternoon just walking around Lincoln Road. We found so many cool places, like Water Drop is a water kind of brand, and I have that in England, didn't know that much about it. Went into the store, so we obviously bought some. Then went to Victoria's Secrets, which is so well priced. Swimwear, what else? Oh my gosh, now we're at time. Oh my god, then we went to that store called Fallow Field? Showfield? Yeah, Showfield. Showfield, and it's meant to be like the most interesting store in the world. It was so cool. It's like loads of yeah, pop up small had businesses. So much fun. We had so much fun. You probably saw us in the ball pit. Then the nicest H&M we've ever been to, and then we just popped to Time Out Market, which they're like the best food markets. Kind of, I went to one in New York, and then they got one in Chicago. I think they have one in Boston now, and Miami, and we just got this from the Blackery. So we're gonna have a smalls cookie. Okay, go. Oh. <laughs> Look at the oh. marshmallow! <laughs> mm. Wow. I think that's the best cookie I've ever tasted in my whole entire life. Like, in my whole entire life. <laughs> mm. Mm. I'm allergic to glue. So worth it. Dreamer. We were just looking at these hot guys. Okay. Dreamer, Miami. Apparently, this is the best 
acai. Oh, he's gonna just have to be a very small one to shout out and very full. Oh. I, I don't even care. Can, can I see the sizes? It's as good as everyone is saying. Oh my gosh. Look at that. This is another really great health and well being spot. Like, it's really nice. Good evening. I had a swim at the pool, which was amazing. We went to Walgreens, we got the snacks, and where are we heading we now? We're tomorrow. heading for dinner. We're heading to Coupon, and the famous one is in New York, but you can never get a res. So we're going to the Miami one. I'm very excited. And the concierge. Look at my outfit. The concierge. My outfit. The concierge got us a res. Does she say bride or does she Am say I bride? bride or not? Thank you. She's the bride, so Thank that you. is where we're going. Oh, hey, there we go. So we got a film crew here. We got like a. So we're just heading to dinner as I was saying and as I'm filming these guys come up behind us and they're filming a documentary about an NFL player. We need to find the documentary. Yeah, I couldn't understand who it was. I didn't know. No, I, I didn't know who it was. But we are heading to Carbon. I mean we're very late. So I don't know if they're gonna honor there. the res. Stop, like, stop, don't even say that out loud. I'm gonna honor the res. Don't even it's say fine. that out loud. We're manifesting. Okay, so yes, we are heading to Carbon, which is famous in New York. Amazing, amazing food. But like the hardest place to get a res. And the concierge at the hotel managed to get us a res. Sweet. An early res. But we're going and we can't wait. So pray for us that they still let us in because we're gonna be half an hour late. This is one of the best spots in Miami, the Big Pink. I go every time I come. They do the most insane American portions. It's unreal. Well, we have good free pasta. Oh, oh, you do? Okay, yeah. thank goodness. Thank you. Rigatoni pasta, and I even broke it into portions. You brought a dessert trolley. <laughs> How happy are you that we came to Cobra? That was one of the best meals I've had. I'm hyped. I'm tipsy after my one glass of Chablis. Okay, guys, hop on. <laughs> it's a yes. Uh, nominal. <laughs> nominal. This is Christina just checking the content that we just got because the it's vibe. golden. Right? You nailed it. So you, they can't even see it. They can't, they can't even, the vlog can't even see it. You'll have to follow us both on Instagram and then you can see the content. Casual plug. So we had Kelly and she was phenomenal. Like she was phenomenal. She was so nice. She got to come right in New Orleans. She was also a bride to be. So she loved Christina. We were like, this is the warm up, the pre bachelor wrap. The food, guys? I can't even. The famous one. The, the we had the vodka, vodka pasta. pasta. It was a taste And they made a sensation. gluten for us and it was actually Like, I'm not gluten free and I I um, substituted my real pasta. You sacrificed. I sacrificed and it was divine. <laughs> the bread But she was also bread. saying that sometimes like the the clients send the pasta back because they're like, there's no way this is gluten free. Like, I don't believe bad. this is gluten free because it's too good. But basically Mario Carbon is like a super famous chef and it's so hard to get into his restaurant in New York because he's like a celebrity hotspot. Like last time I tried to go to the one in New York, ASAP Rocky was just chilling outside, which is very cool. And it's kind of like everyone goes there, but it's actually good food. The one in Miami is beautiful it's like huge the atmosphere the vibe the fact that they bring over a dessert trolley the, the fact that they brought me a block of parmesan cheese as soon as they literally down. you sit down and they bring you the best bread ever christina's gluten free so i ate all the bread <laughs> but i ate me. all the parmesan and then they bring you the parmesan parmesan you say i say parmesan <laughs> comment below guys is it parmesan like comment comment Jan like Janice. I also Janice. Get, I also get in a big argument with my fiance between like a steak. It's fillet. Parmesan. No, but also a steak fillet or a steak fillet. Really upsets me when people say steak fillet. Comment below, guys. Is it fillet or fillet? And fillet. Oh, or is it fillet? <laughs> fillet. 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 Or is it what was the other one we were talking about? Parmesan or Parmesan. Parmesan or Parmesanis. Janice. <laughs> like, what the heck? Um, yeah, we've had one glass of wine and we're living. Literally. <laughs> it's been the best day. Like, I can't even. I can't even. I'm very grateful. Okay. Next stop. We are actually, you're gonna, you're gonna hate me for this, but we're heading back to where we went last night. <laughs> because we want guac and chips. 
and a little drink and apparently there's a DJ. Like obviously the pasta um, didn't fill us up. No, the pasta did fill me, but I always have room for guacamole. Yeah, yeah. So that's where we're heading. Back at the hotel, oh where we belong, with the guac and chips and the mojito. I am never mad about guac and chips. We just got back to our room. We are in love with the concierge. He is incredible. Honestly, we love him. Morning, Miami. It's time for another beautiful day in Miami. We are on the coffee hunt. Getting love from my city, yeah. I roll call for the DMV. In my own lane, you could still ride with me, yeah. No one knows I made mistakes. You won't end, but it's too late. I don't need your support just to know. <laughs> Good morning. Welcome. So, Christina and I are starting the day. We just did the best yoga class on the beach. Yep. In the best way. Oh my god. We possibly can. Waking up we feel from amazing. your shavasana with the sun in your face we and went the ocean. We went to one hotels. We got a matcha and a coffee. We walked on the beach this morning. We feel amazing. We did beach yoga. Our hotel has it included. I mean, an absolute dream. This is our pool. It's actually two pools in our hotel. Second one. We're gonna get ready and we're gonna go to a cafe that we are so excited about for breakfast this morning. Breakfast at Tiffany's! Breakfast at Tiffany's! A little Audrey Hepburn moment! I know, I can't wait. So let's go get ready and then, wow, I'm so hyped after this morning. How amazing! Good morning! So we had an amazing workout and we are now heading for breakfast. My hair just does not sit well in Miami. I've had this issue before. I got the blow dry last time I came. Big, dis big mistake, big mistake. <laughs> Wrong decision, a big mistake. Because it's like the humidity. We're humid, but we're happy. Happy, humid hunts. So, where are we going for breakfast? Berries and cream. <laughs> Berries and cream. Uh, if you're we're American, going to breakfast. comment if you know the advert. <laughs> <laughs> like a decade ago. Um, we're going to breakfast at Tiffany's. Breakfast at Tiffany's is a pop-up that's in Miami and it's in the Miami Design District and there's amazing designer shops over there so we're going to go for breakfast in the pop-up Tiffany store and then we're going to explore the designer Look stores. Diamonds. Look at some diamonds. Diamonds are a girl's best friend. No guacamole is. Okay. Honestly? Yeah. I feel like Jake should have put my ring in a bowl of guacamole. <laughs> and you just like take a bite of the taco and then you're like, oh, crack your tooth. Will you marry me? Yes, Hell I will. Yeah, I will. <laughs> okay, so on that note, let's go to Breakfast and Tiffany's. We're in a cab just because it is a two hour walk. It's like over across the bridge. So let's go. Oh, has she found another engagement ring that she wants? <laughs> a new engagement oh ring. God. Oh, she's sending a picture to the fiance. She is. She but is. look, it's Tiffany Knot. It symbolizes the power of connections between people. Oh, Isn't that beautiful? A little hinty hint to um Santa. She's trying it. It's nice. The green vibes. This is stunning. So this is the shops at Midtown. So we've just done the designer stores and now they have some stores here. 
cute little store here actually that's like a juice bar with lots of healthy smoothies good morning so we started the morning at tiffany which was basic but like really really good and then we actually that was in the design district and the design district has so many nice like cafes and restaurants and designer stores you know your dior your chanel it has everything cartier they also had a lot of really fun like art exhibitions that yes. were interactive that you could you know go and play it was on really it nice. was a really cool area it's such a cool area it's like a 15 minute uber from collins avenue at the addition which is where we're staying which is like miami beach area definitely worth heading over there and then we actually walked for like 10 minutes through the designer stores we ended up at nordstrom rack which is like the sale nordstrom always go to some bargains and that was like midtown now we're just wandering to winwood so when i came to miami like 10 years ago my first trip this area is so i would say gentrified is that the right yeah, word it's like gentrified now and it's like where everyone comes for like the coolest tacos like all of my restaurant recommendations pretty much are in this area so what are we doing now we're going to get, get lunch. lunch winwood is also really famous for like art murals so if you're into art like there's really cool art murals everywhere it's kind of like hipster vibes gives me like it's hackney familiar. in london vibes or like the shortage. mission in san francisco the mission in san francisco i had the best chinese food of my life there in like this restaurant that you wouldn't think anything of it and you go in and it's just insane so we're gonna go check out this donut shop yeah look at this a tower bar very cool So good in New York, they're like really good foodie pop-ups. No way. That they have all of it. Christina's saying this is reminding her of Abbott Kinney in LA. Lovely denim. Lots of nice like independent stores. Yeah, it's really cute. Yeah. Except for Joan. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> you wanted to say hi to my vlog, so I vlogged him. Oh! Miami Vice. Oh my gosh. Look at these socks, that is hilarious. Let's go shopping. That is cute AF. I feel like I look like a wow, I don't think that. This is such a nice store. Wow, great in here. Oh, I love them. Oh, nice. Look, oh, oh, the cutest. store is stunning. I like that. Goodness, this store is a work of art. <gasps> wow! One I wanted like Miami Look at this. Show the vlog. Yes, gorgeous. I mean, this entire yeah. New favorite store. Thank you. Bye. Ever. We love sweet green great salad bowls. Thank you. Wow. Cheers, ladies. Cheers. <laughs> Oh my gosh, we have a bowling alley in our hotel. We did not realize. Good evening. We are ready. I'm wearing meals, much unlike me, but we're heading to a place tonight called Komodo, which is meant to be amazing. 
so I have margarita to start the night. We've had a great day. We did get caught in a little bit of rain, and then I had to get quite an expensive Uber back, but we smashed it. We had a great day at Wynwood, and a nice day shopping. And now, what are we drinking, baby G? Champagne. She's in the champagne. And, oh, that, that's my Apple Watch, just ruining every shot as per. Oh, divine. from a windy Miami beach but the sun is shining and it's amazing got my earphones in because I just did the most amazing workout took myself some self care we basically got up got a coffee from a cute little coffee spot down the road and then we did a workout so I've done Christina's just in the room writing some cards for the bachelorette today is the official start of the bachelorette because I'm not sure if I told you but this is like the warm-up this is like us being here to kind of get over jet lag have a nice few days of exploring and then all the other girls land today ready for the actual bachelorette so sad because it means we have to check out of the most amazing hotel our hotel has been just incredible we've had the best time here and the concierges have been sensational so shout out to the concierges who have helped us so 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 much Two of the girls arrived last night and we went to a place called Komodo, which is owned by a guy who's called like Mr. Miami. So apparently it's meant to be like the best food. And it was good, like the vibe was good, the food was good. I would say it's like um, a bougier version of Tao if you guys have been to Tao. Like it was really good, but I think the problem is Carbon was so good <laughs> that nothing. I just feel like we peaked, we peaked, we had such a great time. So today we're gonna do a bit more exploring, go for a nice swim. Christina just wants like a slow chill morning because it's gonna be quite a um, busy one with the batch. So I've had an amazing few days. If you made it this far, comment and write palm tree because not that side, but this side. There are palm trees. Can't believe I'm vlogging by myself down Miami Beach, but you know, America baby. But thank you so much if you watched it this far. I know it was a really long vlog. Everything I mentioned, where, etc., will be linked below. This is your sign to go on a batch to Miami with your friends because it was just amazing I'm feeling very very grateful the gratitude I have for moving my body working out having ocean breeze having great food so thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys on the next vlog because I'm gonna do the batch as a second vlog see you soon <laughs>